Um, so we may be doing some hotel room shenanigans. Just me and you. Hey everyone, welcome. My name is Martha and this is my Moxie Life. I post new content every Monday at 3 p.m. Pacific time. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button and the little bell so you'll be the first to know anytime I post new content. Thanks for joining me today. Today's video is a three day work trip vlog. I hope you'll enjoy it. dead as a doornail here today. It is so hot outside. It's really hard for me to keep my mask on because I keep fogging up my uh, glasses. Um, flight's really open as usual so I won't have any trouble getting on and I'm gonna sleep in Oakland tonight and then tomorrow I have two legs. One to Denver and then back to San Francisco overnight in San Francisco and then um, one to Denver, one to Pittsburgh, overnight in Pittsburgh, and then Pittsburgh back to Denver, and Denver to Oakland, and I'm done, and I think I'm done at like 10 a.m., y'all. So I'll be home by like probably two or three at the latest on Saturday. And then I don't work again, um, theoretically until like the 30th, um, but, oh sorry, extreme close-up. Um, I might pick up something. They are offering a lot of time and a half trips, so I might pick up a trip. And uh, yeah, so come along. I don't know if it's gonna be a very exciting trip or not. I heard things were closing down again in Pittsburgh. Things closed down again in California. Um, so we may be doing some hotel room shenanigans, just me and you. <laughs> Alright, I'll talk more later. Hello, I am in my hotel room waiting for my food that I wasn't going to get because I wasn't hungry and I'm fine, I have snacks. But then I was like, well maybe I should eat because it isn't that late and I still have a long time and... Now I'm waiting for my food and I'm starving. All of a sudden, I cannot wait for my food to arrive. So I don't know how long I have, but um, I'm getting some garlic and butter chicken noodles, something from, it's an Asian place? But let me see, let me check. I wanna tell you what the name of it is because it's funny. It is called Monkey Grill Pub and Grub. Would you guess that that is Asian? I don't know, but it is. Can't wait. Yum yum. I'll show it to you when it gets here. Mmm, so good. So buttery and so garlicky. Mm. Right across from the runway in San Francisco. Watching planes land. Take me out to California. Take me out to California. I feel the day is coming to an end. And my eyes are drawn to southern skies. That was and cool. all the one on the right, one on the left. The second one was actually on the left. I thought he was on the right. It is actually a really beautiful day. It's a little windy, but I am definitely glad I got out of my room. I'm so tired from not sleeping last night. So hopefully tonight will be better and I will sleep. Um, I really already ate my food and I don't really want to spend any more money. I just walked over to a lobster place which is like right over here um, and I want 
to want it, but I am just not hungry, and oh god, I love lobster so much. So this will definitely be on my list for next time. I will save my appetite. But, um, so for the rest of tonight, I will probably be in my room. Uh, yeah. I don't have any big plans. <laughs> I don't know if the bar is going to be open here, and I already have drinks packed, so I'll probably just have my drink and uh, watch a movie or something. Exciting doings here in San Francisco, people. I just had an interesting thought that I thought I might share with you all. As I was walking, I realized right ahead of me, on the other side of the water, or not on the other side, but like further down, is uh, <laughs> the hotel where I had my very first airline interview ever. And I think I talk about this in one of my videos. I'll link it up above. Um, I think it's from my You're Not Too Old to Be a Flight Attendant video. But my very first airline interview was here in San Francisco. Well, this area is called Burlingame. But uh, right over there, I interviewed with Alaska Airlines and they did not hire me. <laughs> and when they said no is when I realized how bad I wanted the job. And so I went the very next, I don't know if it was the very next day, but it was pretty quickly after that, I went to Fresno and went to a SkyWest interview, and that's when SkyWest hired me. Yes, SkyWest! So, that is my humble beginnings. I will show you guys where, whoops, sorry. <laughs> I'll show you guys. So, I'm gonna stop, so I'm not bouncing. Right there, see the white, uh, where's my finger? I'm trying to like point it out. But can you see the white uh, hotel with the like red roof? That is where I interviewed and got rejected. <laughs> the other direction over there, you can see uh, the city. There's San Francisco. So that's, you can tell how far we are actually from the city from where the airport is. Oh, whoops. Nice videography. And I'm so proud of myself, I brought my microphone, and then I left it in my room. So, <laughs> I am such a good YouTuber, YouTube creator, whatever I'm supposed to call myself. Um, but yeah, so there's the city. So I came inside and I thought I'd get myself a little treat. Um, I was looking in the, the, they have some beers and stuff. Check out these prices. These cans of wine are $15. The beers are $10. For a can. You know what that is? What's a bunch of it? So, um, I had some inkling that I would go to the city because I thought, I don't know what I was thinking when I looked at my schedule. I thought I was getting in at one. Um, it's after four and I am not going anywhere because we have to be downstairs at 545, which is 245. Yeah. Uh, West Coast time? Yeah, so I'm going to bed. I'm going to eat and I'm going to go to bed. Um, that's pretty much it for me. Uh, I'll give you a little room tour. It'll be quick. <laughs> it's a nice room. It's just small. All right. Come in. Full length mirror. 
bathroom is nice lighting, a little clock in the mirror thing, that's cool. Uh, my favorite Yay! oven shower, like usual. Okay. A big old closet, I mean if you were staying a while, with like a dresser and stuff. And then one bed, whatever, big queen <laughs> chair, it's funny. And then here's the view, parking lot, and freeway, and airport entrance, some runways over there, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I will not be going to the city. It is uh, about a 20 minute drive and like a $30 Uber. Um, so next time I'm here I'm hoping, I guess a lot of the overnights are just doing short and putting them at the airport since there's really nothing to do. Um, a lot of places are just not open but um, I guess there's more places open now here than have been. Um, the restaurant here is open for takeout um at the hotel but i'm going to be a good girl and eat the food that i brought because i spent so much money on my last trip <laughs> so i should probably actually make some money when i'm working i mean it's just a fact but um all right and then i'm gonna go make a funny tiktok that i've been wanting to make so follow my tiktok just for fun I guess I should tell you what my TikTok is. It's My Moxie Life. Shocking, I know. Um, I'll put a link in the description. Um, let's talk about TikTok just for a minute because uh, I know it's kind of weird that I'm doing TikTok. I mean, in my mind it's weird. I don't know if you guys think it's weird. But uh, the reason I started doing TikTok is because A, pandemic and bored. Um, and then I have deleted it and put it back on my phone like three times because it is literally a hole that you fall into and you can't stop swiping. Stop swiping. So then, um, I saw another a YouTube, um, flight attendant, um, who was putting some cool stuff on there and I was like, oh, you don't have to do the dances and you don't have to do super funny stuff but then I saw something funny so I'm doing little fun um, hotel hacks and travel hacks and then also I have to do this one so go over there and check it out I'm gonna put it up good morning guys it is day three and down to the lobby um, this hotel is attached to the airport or like right next to it so it's walkable, so I don't have to be too many on my hair. Well, it looked good a minute ago. It's already going flat a little bit. Yep, it is what it is, I guess. What can I do? Can't control the humidity, can I? Hey everyone, I am back in my car in Burbank. Um, and ready to go home and I'm actually not feeling that great so I'm hoping it's just being tired because a lot of times when I feel tired I feel like I'm getting sick but I'm really just tired so um, yeah hopefully I just need a good night's sleep but yeah these AM trips I'm kind of regretting bidding for AM but oh all right Another trip in the books. Check. Goodbye.